What's going on guys? It's your boy Nick Arg here in today's video. I want to introduce you guys to Zone Wars Roulette. So in this video, I'm going to be going over everything you need to know about the competition, such as how you can actually play in it yourself, how you can watch the competition, how you can bet on people in the competition, and most importantly, throughout all of this, you're going to be earning these points called ARG bucks, and that's going to be earning you in real life money and V-Bucks once you get enough. I'm going to go over that later in the video, but first off, I want to tell you guys what Zoners Roulette actually is. So Zone Wars Roulette is basically a regular game of Zone Wars, but with a little bit of a twist. The first person to get eliminated each round is out for the whole entire competition until there is one person standing at the end of it. But wait, there's more. That's not all. To spice up the gameplay, I introduced this system called Arg Bucks. This, this rewards people who are playing in the Zone Wars matches who do well, but also people who are going to wager and bet on those people who do well to earn more Arg Bucks, such as this chart on screen right now. As you guys can see, if you're playing in the Zone Wars, you'll be getting 200 Arg Bucks for coming in first place, 150 for second place, and 100 for third place. People who are going to spectate and wager and bet their R bucks on the person who comes in first place will be getting 150 R bucks, second place will be getting 100, and the third place winner will be getting 50. And to get a $10 V bucks card, you'll be needing 4,000 R bucks in total. So that's all fun and games, but let's get right to the actual stuff the rules. So was that intimidating? I hope so. But anyways, the first rule, players cannot team up with other players in a Zone Wars match. I'll have multiple spectators in the lobby and this thing called replay mode. If you end up teaming, I will end up finding out and disqualifying you from playing from every tournament as well as betting on people in it. It's not a good idea. Don't do it. I promise. Also, as a player, you must attend the days where Zone Wars is being held. I'm going to try and lean it towards the weekend because I know a lot of people may not be able to play during the week. I'll be lenient. I got you. And if you want to be a player, join my Discord, message me on Twitter, message me on Instagram so I can get in contact with you and give you all the details for the matches and everything like that. But let's get right to the next rule, and this is involving the spectators. If you're a spectator and you cast a bet on a player that is already out, your vote will be discarded. Plain and simple. And for placing your bets on people, how that's going to work is I'm going to make a video a couple days before I host the matches to show you guys who's playing each player. I'm going to link their channels or something down below so you can check out each player, know who you're going to bet on and everything like that. But with that said, if you have any questions regarding anything with this event or anything I mentioned, let me know down below in the comment section. One question that you probably have, somebody else definitely has as well. So let me know down below. Drop a like on this video if you are excited. Guys, I am so freaking excited to give you guys this. I've been hyping up in my head for so long. I'm so glad it's happening. Stay safe. I'll see you guys tomorrow. Peace out.